this dress is a lot going on hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel if this is your first time watching i'm sheree welcome if you happen to be returning thank you so much you are truly truly appreciated and welcome back i hope everyone is doing well today you guys happy sunday sunday over here for me is like a whole different vibe like i love sundays would you say sundays is your favorite day of the week yes it really is anyways i hope you all are doing well you guys i have some amazing fabulous fragrances that i want to share with you today that are perfect for right now being the season that we are in which is summer i have some fresh i have some clean i have some floral i have some sweet i have some date night who would even what she wouldn't even do a video if i couldn't even talk about date night okay you guys i love date night anyways i've been dating in the house a lot but i'm still spraying on my fragrances if you want to hear the 11 fragrances that i have to share with you for today then please continue to watch i am still trying to hit 20k before my birthday which is in august so you can help me do that that. If you love the content, please hit the subscribe button if you're already liking the vibe of the video. What are you waiting for? You don't have to wait any longer. Go ahead and hit the like button. Without further ado, let's get into this video. Going in no particular order, but I am going to start with my freshies. So I am going to share with you just a little bit about them, just because I don't want this video to be extremely long, so I'm not going to go into a huge in-depth about notes and everything like that. But you definitely know she's going to paint a picture and tell a story. If you're ready, let's go. Coming in is Chance Chanel V. This is a fresh, clean, citrus, grapefruit, beautiful fragrance. This is very fresh, very clean, very citrusy. It's very fruity kind of too, but the fruit would be like a grapefruit. It's grapefruit, blood orange, jasmine, cedar, and iris. It's a beautiful fragrance. I recently added this. Immediately when you first spray it, you do get that burst of zest, a burst of grapefruit, citrus, just a very citrus type fragrance. It is fresh, it is clean, it is easy breezy. This is definitely a fragrance that I would continue to keep in my collection and it's perfect for summer it's perfect for spring depending on where you live you can probably get away with it year-round I move on sticking with the same family this is another Chanel this is e fresh this is a green one that I oftentimes refer to it as both of these are Edie toilettes so they have been in my collection for a while this one has this one has been in my collection for a while it's really good I used to love to wear this to work going to the office I worked in the gym this was really good like I said easy breezy fresh scent out of the shower, do your hair, it's no fuss, no hassle. Um, this probably gives a moderate when it comes to longevity as well as the other one that we just spoke about. They're both moderate type fragrances. I would say anywhere from four to five hours. If you wanted it to be beast mode, beast mode, you would definitely have to, hello, go ahead and hashtag it. Spray heavy, definitely spray heavy. Also, you might be able to carry a little decant or something in the car or in your handbag if you were going to be out for a long period of time. But this is definitely a way to this is actually like a summer favorite a summer classic it's been around forever and it's on so many lists that just comes to mind that just says how great of a fragrance this is like I said it is an EDT so you will need to go ahead and spray a little heavy if you want it to last a few of the keynotes in this fragrance is citron jasmine teakwood it's very zesty it's very like sparkling it's just a really great fragrance so if you're looking for something a easy reach anytime anywhere type fragrance check out Chanel chance if Fresh. It's a really great way to go. I move on. It's this one by Tom Ford. I have the original and I also have this one. This one is the Twilight. This is a little bit lighter. You guys, this is really good. I oftentimes refer to this fragrance as a vacation in a bottle, very coconut. It's an upbeat type fragrance. It's very luxurious. It's very luminous. It's just, like I said, get your entire life. Stella got her groove back. It would be great for a summer date. If you were dating, you were going out somewhere for the summer. Even if someone was coming over and you sprayed this on before they got to the house you don't have to spray heavy um it lasts moderately on its own with a normal four to six eight to ten spray you didn't hear that from me for a good like seven hours six hours however if you do want it to last all day you're going to be out all day or you're going to not be in such close proximities you could spray a little bit heavier or carry a little decant or you can also layer it with the body shimmer or you can also layer it with like a fragrance lotion that would also help to preserve this some of the key notes in here you guys would be bergamot orange bed it also has the Lang Lang pistachio accords and it also has the beautiful note of sea coconut which is a beautiful note in this fragrance and I think that's 
that's what really makes it come alive from oh my gosh see every time you know how some of them if you can relate to what I'm saying you can take the cap off of some of your fragrances and just go in for that whiff and it automatically just transports you back to a time and place where you wore it what you were doing the vibe you were feeling and this is just always summer August always around my birthday and I just absolutely love this fragrance. So you guys, this would be a great one. If you do not have this in your collection, I highly recommend getting your nose on it. It's definitely worth a whiff. I move on. Another great one that would be really good for spring, really good for summer, probably could be worn year round, but I have found it to really shine and show itself in the summer months when it's hot, muggy, just heat, sweaty. This here, and this is Tiffany Sheer. I love this fragrance. Actually, the bottle, okay? Can we take a moment for the bottle? It's so gorgeous. I love this bottle. It's absolutely Absolutely everything it looks beautiful on any vanity Tiffany sheer is a great way to go Tiffany and Co actually is what it's called but this is sheer I got the sheer when they have another version of it but it's real oh see it's bright immediately when I spray this I get sparkling and I get bright I get effervescent I get upbeat it's just a beautiful fragrance it's very sparkling it has a very clean vibe if you were working in the office this would be great if you were going like on a lunch date and you're meeting somebody this would be something you would wear if you were gonna meet someone's parents if you were going to be introduced to someone special or you just wanted to leave like you know a little bit of a lasting impression you came in but you didn't show up you know but you came in <laughs> you would wear something like this let me give you feel the notes you guys this has black currant ylang ylang it also has rose oil it's just a beautiful scent i even think that this would be a great scent for a wedding if you were going i know i talked to some of you and you're like girl i'm going to a wedding what should i wear you guys it is so fun when you send me those messages over in the dm i feel like we are going together anyways i digress back to what i was saying if you would happen to be going to a wedding something where it was warm it was outdoors even if it was inside this would be a great fragrance to wear and that is tiffany and co and this is sheer I move on another one another one one of my favorite I could have just made all of these Chanel but I tell you every video it would be so boring but I could truly make the whole video all about Chanel this is Gabrielle Chanel you guys I often time tell you I picked this up in Paris in 2017 when it first launched this is a beautiful beautiful fragrance yes we know but girl spill the tea tell us the truth it doesn't perform well. It does not last very long. You definitely will have to carry a little decant in your car, your handbag, your backpack, whatever you're carrying and rocking these days. If you want it to smell it all day, this is not the one. They do have Essence and I have a complete comparison video between this one and Essence on the channel. If I can remember, I will link a card or I will link it after this video. But this is a beautiful white floral scent and I could not leave it out because not everybody wants to do the most. I mean, she loves to do the most. You already know that. But some people are like, I don't have to do the most. I just wanna put something on, smell pretty, and go about my day. And if that's something you're looking for, this is a great, easy reach to do that. Let me give you a few of the notes. It has white floral, it's citrus, it's woody. You guys, it has orange blossom, jasmine, tube rose, it has black currant, sandalwood, and musk. It is made up of some of my absolute favorite fragrance notes. It just does not perform. However, if you have this and you're thinking, well, Sheree, how can I get it to perform? I often share this tip in a lot of my videos when talking about this fragrance. That is, they do have the body lotion, they have the body crops so you are able to go on and maybe buy the lotion or the crops or the hair mist and layer it that way that way it will preserve the fragrance and help it with longevity and that is none other than Gabrielle Chanel beautiful fragrance beautiful bottle even in itself the bottle is beautiful as well really like it it just doesn't perform very well but I did not want to leave it out because I do reach for this all the time in the summer after the summer this would also be great for work great for church great for brunch great great for girls night, anything like that. You're gonna be subtly there. They're gonna smell you and notice you, but you wouldn't have come in just like knocking and turning heads, okay? It's not one of those. But this is a great way to go. So I wanted to bring that one up and that is Gabrielle Chanel. I move on. Okay, another one I'm gonna talk about. You guys, I cannot believe how much this fragrance right here is just coming up in every video. Okay, that is this one here. I showed this in my favorites video. I was telling you how much I really like it, how much I really enjoy it. And it's become like a favorite now. Look how much I've used. I have a lot of fragrances. That's a pretty good amount that I have used. This is Escada Miami and I absolutely love it. It is so good. I have been using it as an easy reach at night. Showering, going down to hang out in the kicking it kitchen, the kicking it couch, the kicking it game room, wherever we're kicking it at in the house these days. I have been reaching for this and it's so 
good and it was so affordable. If you don't know, I told you in the last video. I stumbled across this at Ross, I believe, you guys. I paid no more than $25. I, I, and I could be making that up. I could have paid less. But I want to say I didn't pay any more than $25. This is a new release as well. I mean, well, it came out in 2019. It's a limited edition. It's a great fragrance. Let me give you a few of the notes as I spray and refresh myself with the... I've been wearing it. And my guy, he really likes this. Every time I wear it down to the couch, he's like, oh, what are you wearing? And I'm like, it's so good. It's good, good. Okay, let me give you some of the notes. It's a very fruity. Before I even give you some of the notes, let me get your mind here. Think of a tropical vacation. You're staying in the hotel, and then you're getting ready to go. Oh, my God. Oh, God, stand in the hotel. I love hotels, you guys. Okay, I have not been in one since February, right? Yeah, I'm a big hotel girl. I love luxury resorts and hotels, so I can get my entire life with this fragrance. Anyhow, back to what I was stating, or back to what I was saying. This is something you would be staying in the hotel, you'd be getting ready to go down, the sun is set, you know, it's just like, you know, just twinkling off the water, the sun and the water, you get the vibe, and you're going down, you've got your swimsuit on, you've got your, I don't know, sunscreen, tan, whatever, okay, I don't know what people are wearing these days, but I am definitely SPF down, okay, because she has no time to be burned by the sun, so I would definitely reach in my bag and just spritz this on all over me, I mean, I'm going to smell like a cocktail, if you know what a cocktail smells like, like a very fruity, pina colada, tropical type of cocktail. That's what this smells like, a cocktail in a bottle that smells very fruity. Let me give you some of the notes. It's got watermelon in the top notes. It's got watermelon and orange. Middle notes, it has pineapple. And then it has tierra flower jasmine. And the base notes, it does have sandalwood and musk. So it is sweet, it is fruity, it is full, not really floral, but it is sweet and it is fruity. And it's just a tropical vacation and a bottle if you have not tried this it's good good I did try and look to link where it was being carried because I didn't see it in any of the stores and I did see it at fragrance X or fragrance net it'll be linked in the description box below I move on we're still in the summer you guys it's still summer but you still got to get that sexy date night on right you still got to go out whether you're dating in the house whether you're going back out I know places have opened and places have shut back down okay that's why I'm just staying in the house okay because I don't have time to be going out coming back I mean look what are we doing what are we doing anyhow I do want to go out though but I'm just saying all right so anyhow you're staying in the house you're going out you're going to dinner I don't know okay whatever you're doing you know what another great fragrance would be for that this one here and I've spoken about this one a lot too and I absolutely love that this is Dylan blue I love Dylan blue it is very granny Smith apple yes I know it is I am not I'm trying my best you guys to not spray cards anymore unless I absolutely have to I'd rather just put all the fragrances on me okay because fragrances are expensive and she doesn't have a lot to waste so yes I will be spraying it on somewhere else in my arm let's go up this side oh not that I need it to be familiarized but it's just good good and I wanted to smell it this would be so sexy for a nice summer brisk breezy date and you're going out and you're sitting out now i feel that this could be worn year round you know what i always say you guys you do fragrance whenever you want i don't care if it's an oud fragrance if i want to wear it in the summer at the scorch of heat i reach and spray whatever i'm in the mood for it doesn't matter what season it is if i'm feeling it i'm rocking it that's just what she does it's what i like to do that's why it's a fragrance collection you pick you choose okay anyways so this one is good a few notes in here you guys it's very fruity it's a fruity floral black currant patchouli granny smith apples it's a beautiful fragrance if you want something to wear on a first second third fourth fifth six seven eight oh if you have that many dates okay this is worthy of a whip definitely try it out if you have not i definitely highly recommend dylan blue it is a fan favorite of hers it just it is and it makes me it makes me happy it's good I, I like it it's classy to me it is not a classy like Chanel kind of classy but it's a classy babe girl kind of classy you know what I mean which brings me to my next one this is Udall by Lancome and this is a beautiful fragrance full dedicated video to all of these on my channel you guys I'm just giving you you know some easy fresh sweet floral summer picks for the time in the season of right now but this one here is a beautiful one this was like a love and sniff at first sight like I picked it up and I was like okay and but I didn't like, I didn't expect to be wow or impressed or anything I really just picked it up because Zendaya you know she's a beautiful girl I was looking at all the marketing ad the campaign behind it and I'm like okay let me see I don't like to be out of a movement I at least like to know something about it so I said let me pick it up and see what the tea is right so I picked it up and I was like oh okay and then I said let me spray it, you know, 
Let me just spray it and see. So I went ahead and sprayed my arms, sprayed the other side, never rubbed them together. I just sprayed and moved about my business. And so then I went and got my nails done and I could not get rid of that scent. I just kept smelling it and smelling it. Even when I went to go wash my hands and came back and I was getting ready to pay, I was like, oh, what is that? You know, this is a great performer. The longevity is here, the sillage is there. It's a compliment getter, compliment grabber. This is just all around the world a great fragrance, in my opinion, in my humble opinion. This is a great fragrance. I think this could be worn anywhere, morning, noon, summer winter spring fall probably really spring summer i would say it would perform its best um in the cold months it didn't perform well for me as well i really like this i do not like this you know that i do have a stand i do hear now that you can buy a stand when you go out check your local macy's if you do have this and you need a stand i actually received a stand when i purchased this so i have a stand but it is a beautiful beautiful fragrance it smells very sophisticated to me very classy very elegant like if you were going to go to a wedding if you were going to go out with a guy <laughs> a date why that makes me so happy oh my gosh you guys this is a sexy date night fragrance okay i cannot help it it just is her mind just goes there let me give you a few of the notes here it's a classic floral i would say jasmine rose citrus um chapera cord it's sophisticated it's classy it's just elegant it's it's a modern classy classic elegant chic woman Okay, she can be all those things. Even a boss, do you get a boss? I do, I get a boss. Is it doing the most? It is, but in a very subtle way. But if you over spray, she could become that girl. That's all I'm saying, I move on. Okay, and you know I could not do the video without talking about a fan favorite, and this is Delina. Absolutely beautiful. This is perfect for summer, perfect for spring, perfect for, any season that you want to wear it you guys but I do know and hear that it spoke about a lot in the spring and the summer this is a beautiful fragrance this will be a beautiful fragrance for a bride to wear to a wedding to go to a wedding to go on a date to go to brunch to go to church to just get out of your house and go somewhere just pick up Delina and just spray it okay it is a beautiful fragrance I cannot say enough about it I told you out of all the notes in this fragrance that really stand out to me it would probably have to be the rhubarb and the lychee the fruit the sweet it just really goes together and I just love it it's effervescent it is bubbly it is sparkly i always tell you that it reminds me of a fizzy bubbly glass of champagne with a nice strawberry on top on a very hot day it's very refreshing and you just take a sip and you're like ah that's how this makes me feel very pretty very feminine very classy very like oh my god when's the coat when's blowing in my hair what is that fabulous smell that's me darling it's that kind of scent okay a few of the notes in it you guys turkish rose vanilla it has cashmere and woods it's got some peony some bergamot it's a beautiful fragrance if you have not heard of this fragrance or you have not been able to get a whiff of it i would highly recommend it it is a beautiful rose sparkly, upbeat type fragrance. And I say upbeat because it really makes me happy too. Being here in quarantine or social distancing, whatever you choose to call it, these are the fragrances that I've been spraying at home in the house. And when I spray them, oh gosh, when I spray them, they just make me happy, okay? I move on. Now, on the channel, I also like to tell you, am I getting ready to cut off? Okay, on the channel, I, I tell you what I love. On the channel, I'm always going to bring you fragrances that I absolutely love. You know what I mean? Because that's how I built my collection. That's how she sets up her collection. But when I'm doing my royalty scent box or if I'm out and I get samples or different things like that, I do like to bring other fragrances to the channel to share with you all as well, just to shed some light, give my 2.5 cents opinion. Oh, you didn't see that one coming, did you? Just to give my 2.5 cents opinion, just in case you wanted it, okay? She's here to give it to you. So. Oftentimes I will do that in a sample size fragrance. This one here is one that I received from Royalty Scents. I spoke about this a couple of weeks ago, you guys. This is Love in White by Creed. This is not my favorite. I do not love this. I will never buy a full bottle of this. I probably shouldn't say never. Mother always told me that. However, I will never buy a full bottle of this. It is not full bottle worthy in my opinion. It is a beautiful fragrance. A lot of you left in the comment section how you wear it, so I did want to share it. Beautiful fragrance for the bride yes what I did not like about it to me it seemed very blah it seemed like it was missing something it didn't have enough growl roar it just didn't have enough sexiness it, it something 
was just missing. I cannot put my finger on it. If I went back and reformulated, I would put maybe some pink pepper in it. Maybe I would put a little bit more uh, sandalwood. Maybe I'd put some patchouli. I don't know. Some vetiver, something green. I mean, something else needs to go inside of here. But if you love it and you're looking for something that you can wear every day, that's appropriate for summer, being the season that we are in right now, this would be a great way to go. If you had not gotten a whiff of it, I would recommend you put your nose on it. I will not recommend that you blind buy this. I can't. I can't tell you to do that because I wouldn't even do it. But I can suggest it. It is really nice. It's a beautiful scent. It's just very blah. And that's just my opinion, but most people really, really, really love this. It was said to be the fragrance that had been worn by Michelle Obama. If that's the case, that gives you a little bit of indication. Very classy, you know, very refined. Just a beautiful, regal, you know, type of scent. You know, and it is. I'm just not buying it. But I wanted to share it with you, okay? I wanted to share it with you. That's it, that's all. I'm moving on from that one. I move on. Another one. This is Floral Botanica by Balenciaga. Floral Botanica by Balenciaga. Beautiful fragrance. Ugh. And, I, and I'm stuck right now because when I first smelled it, and that's why I love doing these, you know, scent boxes or samples or whatever, just to see if I really love it. Because a lot of times, if it doesn't get me at first scent and initially like, oh, I love it, then I won't really buy it. I'll have to play with it a little bit. That has been this one. Now. I'm gonna spray this on the card because, you know, there's just a sample. So I'll spray samples on the card. I'm trying to stop spraying full bottles on the card. Oh, but this is good. It smells like cannabis. It smells like outside when I'm doing my outdoor workouts, my walks, all those trees and plants and everything. <laughs> But it is good. Now, when I first got this, I was like, oh, no, I don't want to get it. You know, it's not full bottle worthy, blah, blah, blah. Um, but then I wanted it. So I keep going back and forth. I still cannot really make up my mind with this. If somebody gave it to me, I'd gladly accept it. The bottle is cute. I thought it was really cute. Let me give you some of the notes and we'll talk. Okay, it is wild mint, Turkish rose. It has vertebra roots. Um, it has some amber in it. It's very moderate. It's very spring, summer appropriate. It is a great fragrance. The longevity is a very moderate longevity. I get anywhere from five to six maybe even seven hours if I overspray it every time I wear this one this is another one that he really likes <laughs> every time I wear it, he's like what are you wearing what are you wearing and I'm like I know I know it's good but I just can't bring myself to buy it you know but I do want it I mean it smells like a mojito it smells like a I don't it smells like cannabis I, I don't know it just smells like green but it's really good it's fresh it's clean it's upbeat I stumbled upon this okay you guys another 2.5 story time okay I stumbled upon this and I shared this story on the channel before I stumbled upon this because we were at a hotel one of her favorites we were at a hotel and it was after New Year's Eve right and so we went up to the rooftop to have brunch and a couple had walked in and when she walked past like I, I, I had to put my food down I was like hold up hold up hold up a second I need to find out what she's wearing. They had just gotten over to their table. She was a beautiful woman, nice big glasses on, handbag, everything that she loves, right? So I was like, oh my gosh, what of us, what of me? I was like, I have to go over and ask her what she's wearing, but I don't want to be rude. They had just got their table. They were just sitting down. They hadn't even placed their order yet. So I was like, no, just let it go. You don't need any more fragrances, let it go. And I just couldn't. That smell kept giving me like one of these numbers. So the projection was there, the sillage was there, at least coming from her, it was there. So I was like, oh, okay. So then once they order, I found my way over to the table and I said, I don't want to bother you. I am so sorry, my apologies, but I just have to know what fragrance you're wearing. It smells absolutely amazing. She told me, I then went, smelled it, and I was like, oh my gosh, I did a little wear test. And then I ordered this one with royalty scent. And I'm like, okay, but I still don't know if it's full bottle worthy or not. So I don't know, you guys, but these are some of the favorite fragrances in my collection that I am reaching for at the moment that are very easy breezy to reach for, to spray on during the summer, during the spring, but especially right now, even with it being warm, with it being hot, these are some great choices to reach for. It's been real. Until next time, you know the drill. Be blessed, stay fit, stay fabulous, but more importantly, stay safe. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.